Hey, how's it going? So it's it's been a little while since I've done this, and um, it's been a month and a half. Um, that's a really long time. Uh, <laughs> if you wanted me to be making content, then I'm sorry that I've not been making content. Um, I'm also sorry to me because I had a really good productivity and positivity and just a good thing going and kind of went to shit, uh, <laughs> as you can imagine, hence I haven't posted for a month and a half. Um, so I kind of want to just give like a life update, I'm not going to go into like all of the ins and outs of why I've not been posting, there's been a lot going on, some of which I'll cover, some of which I won't, like clearly I like talking about my life because it's kind of what the channel is, but at the same time I know like there is a line and I don't have to talk about every personal drama that goes on in my life, otherwise I would be here all of the time, which is kind of what I want, but not in that way. Anyway. So, uh, did he, oh yeah, before I start, I have no hair again, um, that's, that's the thing, I cut it all off, again. Yeah, I don't know what I'm doing with it, I kind of want long hair, but I didn't want to grow my hair while some of it's one colour and some of it's another, because then at the growing phase it's going to look really weird. I'm not sure if I like this or not yet. I, it's really low maintenance though, which is good, because my, my blonde was getting too long and it was just greasy all the time. I, I can't be dealing with that. So I guess the main sort of life update thing, I got a job, so I work in a nice fancy office. I wear a suit and, and stuff. I was really nervous for a number of reasons. Um, obviously it's my first full-time job, it's my first being an adult thing. And it was kind of, obviously life is a lot bigger than this, but it it's a major marker in terms of whether I made the right decision or not dropping out of uni. So far it's been really good, it's ironically really similar to lectures so far because we're in an academy so we're doing those training. I feel like I've learned an absolute fuck ton, like I can do taxes and pensions and stuff. I'm, I'm, I'm growing up, I'm being an adult and it's weird. But no, I've met some really cool people, um, none of them know about this yet. No, none of them, none of them know, I haven't mentioned it. So at some point if they are watching this then hello academy people. This is, this is what I like to do in my spare time, not for the past month and a half. Um, but yeah, this is this is how I, I make myself feel cool. They're all really nice. I'm, I'm the youngest, uh, the only 19 year old, everyone else is sort of like 22, 23, 24. With then a couple of people who could be my mum, but they're really nice too. It's all, it's all weird. It's like at uni where there would be people of different ages, but we're all just freshers. We're all in this together. It doesn't really matter. It's the same with the academy to a point like. I don't really see them as older than me, we're just sort of like in it together kind of thing. I don't know, it's not easy to describe, but it's, it's just life, man, it's just life. Um, I just, <laughs> that was weird. <laughs> so yeah, that's kind of taken over my life a little bit. Uh, fortunately, I don't have to commute very far, I can just walk. But yeah, it, it's obviously a very big chunk of my week. So yeah, I want to get back into doing this. Uh, it's frustrating me that I haven't done but I'm not going to be an idiot and think, oh yeah, I can do three videos a week again, like fuck it. Um, I had all of my week free pretty much and I still couldn't always do three a week. I think at this point, rather than be like, hey, this is going to be my schedule, I'm just going to sort of figure it out over the next couple of weeks. So we'll see in terms of that. I want to try and get it to one on here, one on my gaming channel every week, but no promises. Please don't hurt me if I don't. That's kind of the main thing in terms of life updates, I think. Uh, my, my ears really hurt because I went up another size on my stretches this morning. Um, so I'm currently at 4mm. Last weekend I did sort of shoot some of a video because I went up to Luton, but I literally have like travel and then 10 minutes of me talking about why I've not been making videos. So I just missed my train by like a minute, which is kind of frustrating, but it happened. literally all I shot so I didn't really want to make a video out of that because then there's nothing of the actual people that I went to see but also I wanted to focus on actually seeing the people because I'd not seen them for three months rather than showing a camera in their face as much fun as the video would have probably been it was kind of weird sort of feeling like it's like home away from home but also I'm not a student anymore that's not my life next week next week I'm going to a gig so that means a gig video 
I'm going to see Neck Deep supported by As It Is Real Friends and Woes uh, Brixton so that's going to be really fucking cool it's also on Friday the 13th which just like I'm not really superstitious and so it's not in that sense it's just kind of cool that it's Friday the 13th in October and I'm going to a place where I could possibly get crushed uh, no that's not why it's cool but yeah, I'm really excited for that. I get to see uh, two of my mates from back home who are off at uni, um, Joe and Alex. Uh, so that'd be really cool. I haven't seen them for about a month and a half-ish. About a month. It's <laughs> and I also get to meet my friend Beth for the first time ever, which I'm really excited about. Like, obviously, I'm really excited about seeing friends that I already know. I'm really excited about seeing Nick Deep and as it is live. But I'm really excited about seeing Beth. We've known each other for about three and a half, Four years, but yeah, we come back. She was on Birmingham, and Birmingham was like ages away. Uh, so hopefully, all of them will be on camera. I'm not gonna like force them. Like consent is important, but hopefully, they'll all be down to like be on camera and stuff. Also got Dodie's gig uh, on the 24th, uh, also in London, and also meeting up with Georgie and her friend Alex. In terms of Comic Con, I talked about it, but I don't think I'm gonna be able to go. Life, I don't have any money. Uh, <laughs> considering I'm going to two gigs, I, pff, the money department is not doing very well right now. I started my job in September, but I missed the cutoff date, so I get September's money and October's money at the end of October. So that's going to be a nice paycheck, but it means that October is really fucking difficult. Also, I have a lot of friends who are going to be at Comic Con who I could go and meet up with and say hi for a bit and catch up with and film some stuff with, but I don't really have anyone that I would spend the day with, and I wouldn't want to like just jump on one of my friends and be like, hey, I'm going to be with you all day, and then just be a burden. Not necessarily that I think I'm a burden, I'm great. I... It's a weird burst of self-confidence there. If I just go, hey, friend that I met, like, once, or that I haven't met in, like, six months, we're going to spend the day together. It could be kind of awkward, and I don't want to just jump on someone. Plus, obviously, money. But as a sort of counter thing to make me feel better about it. Um, I've already started planning what I'm going to do in May and I think it's... Uh, I won't spill too much now in case it doesn't happen but it's something I really want to put a lot of effort into and try and make and, and, and if I can then it might just be the best thing I've done in my entire life. Except Vedim, because Vedim was fucking cool. So yeah, that's kind of life update stuff, I guess. Um, I feel like I've missed something, but if you if you if you did miss the, the, the videos, then hopefully this is the beginning of them being back. Thank you very much for watching. Um, like, comment, subscribe if you knew all of that fun shit. And as always, my social media stuff is in the description. I don't tend to disappear for a month and a half of that because I kind of. I don't, I don't know, I think I'd get like withdrawal symptoms or something. Not that I'm really dependent on social media, that sounds really bad, I just enjoy it. But yeah, so um, yeah, bye. Uh, peace. <laughs>